I stopped at the Taco Bell to do a video real quick so I could tell y'all that the, uh, the Monday's video will be posted tonight because for some reason last night it took forever to upload. So I'm just making this video real quick. I I'm running errands. I'm going to get some crabs. I look like I'm sweating, don't I? I'm sweating. And um, so yeah, I got Taco Bell. Ooh, do I need to take a thumbnail? I just use probably one of my old photos or something. But anyway, yeah. So that's what I came to tell y'all that um. The video will be posted this evening. I don't know why it took so long. I don't know what was going on yesterday with the thing, child. But yeah, so thank y'all so much for watching the muscles video. I appreciate it. So I just got three tacos real quick, y'all. Mmm. And I got, I know you can't see it. I got this, um, oh, that look better. Because I'm out getting some crab. Y'all see my cooler? Oh, you can't see it. Mm, 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 mm. And I got this little, um, this drink, but I don't, I don't too much care for it, y'all. It's too sweet. I should have watched some reviews on it. It makes me thirsty. Like, it's, it's too sweet. I should have got it without the cream. So yes, child. Yeah. I ain't gonna say much about the video, but I just wanted to come and say I'm sorry. It was my fault because I was supposed to be ready when Kit got back. When Kit got home. Bye bye. Mm hmm. I'm not the only one that got cups in their car from the previous day or something. I got an old Starbucks drink. I don't know why I don't throw them out. Yeah, I don't like this drink, y'all. You gave me mild sauce. I asked for hot. I asked for fire and hot. I guess I just drink it, y'all. Mmm. I think it'd be good probably without the cream. Yeah, I don't, I don't like the cream. They say like pure, pure sugar. I'm just sitting here with my door open. I'm real bold, ain't I? Good gracious. <clears throat> I started to go to um Panera Bread, but I was like, I don't want no, I don't want no, I don't want a lot because I got a film today. So this is just a snack. Don't look at this shirt. This, this is a uh, oil shirt. You know when you be doing them seafood boils. <laughs> and I'm too lazy to just going there and put the little um stain remover on it. Too lazy. I don't even think about that. Mm-mm-mm. Well, anyway, let me tell y'all. So, in the video, <clears throat> I mentioned that a little girl was, um, 
was lost, right? And she came down the house. So me and Keanu, me, Keanu, and Kit was in the house. And I was sitting in the office and I kept hearing something like cry. And I thought it was, so this is story time, y'all. And I thought it was like a cat or something like that. And it, but it kept crying. And I was like, well, no, that sounds like a baby, like a, a child. So Kiana was up in her room and she said she heard it. So Kiana came downstairs and she was like, mom, that's not an animal. That That's like a, a child. That sounds like a child whimpering or whatever, crying or whatever. So she looked out the window and she was like, oh my God, mom, it's a child in the backyard. <laughs> so, so we go, I go in the backyard and it's a little girl. And she had to be around two. I'm thinking she was two. Almost three, but I don't think she was even three now that I recall. But, and I was like, well, what's your name? And she told me her name, but I forgot. And I was like, well, where's your mom? And she was like, you know, I don't know. But she just felt better that she was with somebody at that time. I don't know where she come from. I don't know where she came from. I don't know who she is I, you know what i'm saying so um by the time we never did take her in the house i told kiana to go get her some some water because it was hot outside she was sweating and by the time we did all that some ladies was coming down the street yelling her name and then when she saw him she like lit up like you know that's you know almost like that's my mama and she was like oh my god you know thank you so much i don't know how she left us they were down the street working on the house doing like um what do you call that when you volunteer to like paint people house and help them fix up their house and make upgrades to the home and you do it as a unit i don't know what you call it like you know, kind of like Habitat for Humanity, but I guess it was a different name of their nonprofit organization. So they were down at the house, maybe like 10, 10 houses down, more, maybe more than that, because it was way on the corner. I don't know how she got all the way to our house, but there was like maybe like 15 houses down. And she wandered down to our house in the backyard. I don't know how she ended up going in the backyard either, but I guess we left the gate open or something. But yeah, her lady came and she was like, oh my God, thank you so much. By this time, you know, the officers that got there too. And there was nothing else to do, but as I, she said, you know, that was her mom and all this kind of stuff. But anything, like anything could have happened to this little baby. She must have been gone a long time because she was with us at least 40, 45 minutes to an hour. I guess before they missed her. But it was crazy. It was scary too because I'm like, what if no one would have come you know, to claim her or say she was missing or I don't know. And of course, you know, at two years old, well, some kids might, but she may not know a phone number. <clears throat> so do people even teach their kids their phone numbers anymore? Since they got these little cell phones, they just push a button. When my kids are growing up, you know, you teach them your phone number, your address, your mama first and last name, your daddy first and last name.
But I don't even know if they do that anymore. Because kids start having cell phones <laughs> before they turn one. With all their shows and stuff on. And I mean, I can't blame them about the phone number, but because... I only know about five good phone numbers. I think I know five phone numbers. And I'm lying. I don't even know five phone numbers. I know... Girl, I know one phone number. <laughs> Y'all, I know one phone number. Now I'm looking crazy. Time I do the kids no phone numbers. I think I know one phone number. Let me think. Hold on. I'm so used to pushing the button. Oh my gosh. How many phone numbers do y'all know right off the bat? Like without looking, just straight up. And let me tell you something, like your grandparents' phone number, your mother' phone number, I know those phone numbers because they kept the same phone number for like 30 years. They never changed phone numbers. And we change phone numbers more often. And it ain't even that, it's just that we push buttons. Why does this hair feel like it's in my face? Oh, because it is. OMG. Y'all yeah, don't know. That's a shame because if I'm in your city and I don't have my phone or something, I can't even call you. That is crazy. I can't even call you. Oh, I forgot to ask for the Doritos one. The flaming hot Cheeto one is gone. But that one thing about them, they don't keep things long. I can tell you that. Let me stop opening these things with my mouth. I shouldn't have been doing it in the first place. But yeah. So this is just a quick video, y'all. Let me eat this last taco so I can uh, run these errands real quick. Go back home. And keep this thing moving. Oh, I ordered my card. <laughs> What's his name? What is this? What is his name? Rand. Rand. Almost like Randall, but short for Rand. He was like, could you please get you a, a larger storage uh, card? Okay. So I ordered it today. It'll be here tomorrow. So hopefully the camera won't be cutting off in the middle of the videos. <laughs> that wasn't bothering me. <laughs> but no, seriously. Thank you. Mm -hmm. So It will go at least 30 minutes. And my videos are usually like the normal videos. Anywhere from... um. Uh-oh. 20 to 30 minutes, so. Mm, mm, mm. <clears throat> These are a little saltier. I'd rather have a plain one. Should have got the chalupa. It was good. Last time I had it, it was real good. Mm -mm -mm. I don't know why I keep picking up this thing with this napkin on it. But this just made me thirsty. Like, I want me a Perrier. Now I need to go in the Walgreens and get me a Perrier. Yeah. Mm 
Mm-hmm. Let's see if y'all know who sang this song. I don't want to sing the chorus because then y'all going to get it real easy. <clears throat> I've been listening to it all day. Wait. No, I don't want to sing the chorus. I seen the chorus then. If y'all know it, y'all know it. All right. It said, you're giving me a rush, rush. Every time that you come around and when we touch, touch i can't get enough <laughs> tell me all your secrets i won't tell a soul i'll keep it on the low just tell me what you do that makes me wanna lose control <laughs> Woo! tell me who sang that song mm. Mm -hmm. That's what I was feeling when I was watching. Oh, I ain't gonna talk about the show, but anyway. That's the song that came in my head. Mmm. I've been jamming that song. Just rush your love and ride away. All right, y'all. Just a little something, something. Let me put some lip gloss on. <clears throat> y'all want to know my favorite lip gloss? Every time I do something like that, people be like, uh-uh, they ain't paying you to show people that. <laughs> it's just so smooth. I love it. And it's so cheap. But it does the job. With my two-tone lips. Y'all got two-tone lips, too? I get them from my daddy. Where your lips are like pink and then they're like darker on the outside where it almost looks like you don't even need a liner so it's like a brown here and like a pink here so you put gloss on it can you see and it makes it look like you got on something but you don't well i inherited the two-tone lips from my daddy and i love them i wouldn't change it for the world but anyway my favorite lip gloss is this one black radiance clear gloss that's what i wear just in case you was wondering that's what i wear that's what i wear my car just need a really good cleaning it is junky all right let me go get me a real drink because this this ain't it So I love y'all. Thank you for your patience. I apologize for missing Monday. You know, we don't miss no Monday now. We've been we've been going strong eight, eight Mondays in a row. You know, with the show. This is the first one we miss, and the finale is next week. So whatever. She looking over here like, what is she talking? Who is she talking to and why? Unless I turn y'all on when I go to the um have something to say when I go to the next store. But other than that. See y'all in the comments um, on this video and the next one. <laughs> Bye, y'all.